I am Will McGee. I'm a fifth generation Pearson, the oldest peach farming family left in the state of Georgia. But before the Pearsons, the Rump family actually created uh, the Georgia peach industry. I say that in that this gentleman, Louis Adolphus and Samuel Henry Rump created a peach called the Alberta. And the Alberta was the most famous of all peaches because we finally had a peach that we could put on a train car and ice it and get it up to the populous northeast. And so in the 1870s, he grew a ton of Albertas and word spread out. It was kind of like the gold rush, but it was the peach rush. One of the guys that heard about this guy making all the money was my great-great-grandfather, Moses Winlock Pearson. And so the Rump family, interestingly enough, is on my dad's side of the family. And so while the Rumps were doing their thing, uh, Moses Pearson, he heard about this guy hitting it rich, moved his family down here, planted a bunch of trees, and the rest is pretty much history. Moses had 12 children. My mother was attending Auburn University. My dad graduated and was working in Alabama for Russell Athletic, and they met at a party. Oh my gosh, you're from Fort Valley. I'm from Fort Valley, and they ended up getting married, so they didn't know each other uh, before then, and they kind of brought together the two families by chance. The Pearson family is still going strong, growing peaches on the same exact dirt. The Rump family actually is not growing peaches, but yet my father and his brother have some land in Marshaville on the home place that the Pearsons are actually farming for them right now. So it's a good little full circle between the Pearsons and the Rumps. And so both of these kind of semi-circles land right here on these shoulders. So I get it on both sides. You got a bunch of folks that have passed it down over the generations and it all just kind of comes together for the best.